Hello everyone, and welcome back to another episode of Tomb Raider. I'm Dewey once again. And this time, we have to go to our old ship that uh, caused us to crash on this island. And uh, see what Alex is doing over there. We're not, we're not exactly sure what's going on, but he decided to, uh, he wanted to be a hero. And uh, go in all silent mode and nonsense. So uh, we, have to, we have to go see what's up with him. I don't... He's not as bonsai as we are, so I'm not exactly sure if he can handle going in solo like we can. Uh, but we'll see. What, I don't, what do you guys think? Do you think that he can handle being solo? I'm guessing that a lot of you probably know exactly what's going to happen. And uh, don't spoil it, you little jerks. Because there are people that don't. There are people that are experiencing this for the first time, like me. And like you. Well, actually, this is... So what they say? Oh, shit. What's going on up there? Some woman busted out all the prisoners. Killed anyone in her way. Damn. Seriously? Who the hell is she? I don't know. They think she came in with that new wreck. She killed Vlad during the roundup. What? She killed one of the Russians? Not just one. She took out Dmitri and Nikolai, too. Holy shit. Has anyone told Boris? He's running over the salvage hop on that ship she came in on. I don't think he knows what's going on. When he finds out his brothers are dead? Yeah. Glad I ain't on that crew. The big son of a bitch is gonna lose his mind. Well, <clears throat> this is a interesting predicament that we landed ourselves in here. Maybe he will um, turn around and uh, not be here anymore? Oh. Sorry, buddy. We're, uh, we're just gonna headshot both of you and, uh, be done with it. I need help. You don't need help anymore, buddy. You're dead. Don't have to worry about worldly possessions or any of that mumbo-jumbo anymore. It's so convenient that they placed all these little climbing things here. Just for me. Oh, God. Hmm. I don't think we can climb in there. That kind of looks like barbed wire. And, uh... I'm guessing we'll be able to shoot that out later, because that looks like one of the things I can shoot out with my shotgun. Unfortunately, we can't use the shotgun and climb at the same time. It doesn't work that way. <clears throat> All right, we're almost there. Well, we can't see it quite yet. It's it's over the ridge, through the mountain. <clears throat> to Grandma's house we go. I hope Grandma doesn't live on this island. That would be rather unfortunate. All right. That should do it. What the hell are we gonna tell the enforcers? Don't worry about him. We'll say he lost it. Jumped to his death. But you shot him. Details, man. They aren't ever gonna find his body. Oh, shit. God damn it, brother. Why'd you have to do that? He wouldn't shut the fuck up. It was driving me crazy. Sun Queen this, Sun Queen that. All that goddamn praying and chanting. I couldn't take it. You could've just knocked him out. I lost my temper place brings it out in me. Yeah, but you gotta control that shit. Just keep your mouth shut about it, all right? Fine, fine. Don't worry, I'll keep your mouth shut about it. You won't have to worry about keeping that secret for the rest of your life. Actually, no, you will worry about it for the rest of your life, but... You know, um... Come on! See the arrow? Go, go fetch, buddy! Go fetch! God damn it! Help! Oh. Ah, there we go. Anyone else? No? 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 Okay. I think what's really cool about that little conversation that happened there, though, is it shows us that, um... Ooh, a secret tomb nearby. You guys want to see that secret tomb, make sure you click on the little annotation in the corner. Blah, 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 blah. <laughs> um, so the secret tomb is actually up here somewhere. Um, I'm not gonna go in that direction though because oh book shiny or shiny thing not book this is a trinket anyways this was used by scribes of the chinese royal court it's like an outlet a fancy outlet a small engraving indicates that this was the possession of an imperial ambassador Ooh. um but what i was saying about the conversation is it kind of shows that a lot of people are more what do you call it like trapped here not necessarily uh i don't know they like because like they didn't agree those like at least one of that guy 
What's going on? Oh god. Uh, nothing. <laughs> Whoops. Um, yeah, but the, the, they didn't agree with like what was going on with the sun god, uh, and that they're more like held prisoner on this island. They probably crashed here as well, and then they they got you know they gave a choice either believe in the sun god or die. And I think mean, they just like instead of dying, they're just like, well, well, at least fake to pretend to be you know a fan of the sun god. All right, hooking that shit. That axe must, she must just sharpen it every night when she sleeps. Nope, still don't have something, uh, something strong enough to pull that yet, but uh, we'll find it eventually, I'm sure. The Sun Queen grows old. Soon she will choose her successor. I fear it will be me. I am now her favorite. She dotes on me, calls me her precious first daughter. Like a doll, she always keeps me close to her. Brushing my hair, dressing me in her favorite clothes. It unsettles me beyond words. But more disturbing, she constantly gazes upon my features as if as if she's looking at her own reflection. Yeah, that'd be a little creepy. I'm not gonna lie, some well I get that all the time when I go to bars, girls just stare me down and be like, hmm, yeah, I want some of that. Yeah, no, that's just that. Or is it? Um, but yeah, that would just be creepy. Some person's like looking at you like, <laughs> I will have your body soon. <laughs> it's like, oh, yeah, okay, all right, I'm gonna not be here anymore. <laughs> Bye. I love that all these ancient scrolls are already translated into English. It's nice. Unless, you know, the ancient Japanese were speaking English, which makes perfect sense to me. Yeah. Uh oh. So there's our ship up here. Ship. The endurance. They're tearing it apart. We got some berries. Did you get some berries? Didn't get any berries, but I got some berries. How much money was. We got 400 to spend. And right away, we're gonna get those, uh, that pool of fire arrows. So when you shoot your arrows now, instead of just a little burst of flames, it's like a little puddle of flames. So not bad, not bad. There we go. Stick that. Whoa. That uh, that didn't seem like it was very well in there. It was like in the top. I guess it held up though. Um, that's what we're wanting. Ooh, it's like an old World War II bunker. <clears throat> I'm always curious, so... As you see here, the um, artillery or whatever that is uh, gun there, it it's, has its muzzle blown out. Now, is that does that make it completely inoperable? Or does that mean that you can still use it, but it's just less accurate? Because, I mean, I would imagine you can still shoot something out. It's like, to me, it would have the same effect as a, like, sawed-off shotgun, where... It'll do a lot more damage if it hits something right in front of it, but uh, maybe not as accurate farther. Oh, I, I don't know if there's any gun experts out there, um, because I know like Saving Private Ryan, not Saving Private Ryan, is it Saving Private Ryan? Saving Private Ryan or Band of Brothers? I think it was Band of Brothers. They just throw grenades and those things. Thank you, Jill. All right, try now. This is the way. How many generators is there? What the hell are they using that for? It doesn't matter. They put in the orders. <laughs> but we already shipped up all those portables last week. Are they powering fucking stadium lights? You should be quiet, brother. Don't talk like this. Keep it steady. We're bringing it up. What do you think's going on up at the palace? All that smoke rising over the mountain. If there was a problem, they'd call down. But what about the radio? Nothing but static. Something's going on. Brother, I told you to be silent. Stop this talk. Hold on, it's Jam. Fuck, now what? It's John Kelly's bullshit. Brother, please. I'm not your fucking brother. 
I'm sick of this place. We keep salvaging all this useless shit. We're working our asses off for what? Father Matthias? The fucking Sun Queen? How much longer do... Wait, wait, wait. What? Shit! What the... I didn't What's going on down there? Everything okay? Everything's fine. No! Just get this generator Please. moving again. All right, so you're going to see a little bit of cut here because this part is actually a little bit difficult. Back to work. Um, I tried when I I tried like two or three times to do this stealthily, like just only stealth. Um, and I think it can be done, uh, but as to not waste your guys' time, I didn't. Um, so basically, I just take up the two guys on the top, the right and the left, and uh, then I decided I was going to try to wait over here. And this is this is pretty much the best take that I had. So, um, obviously that didn't work very well. Uh, see, I, I would, I would attempt to shoot that guy in the head, but since he's wearing a mask, I couldn't, uh, oh god, what do you call it? I couldn't shoot him, like, headshot him once. So, yeah, I don't know. Now you just pretty much go into a place where you just, yeah, take cover, avoid the bombs, and, uh kill everyone else in here um it's a lot more work like this is something that i definitely if you guys are interested in i'll try to go back and see if i can do it 100 percent uh stealth because uh, i am playing through the game again on the hardest difficulty on the pc um just to see what the pc looked like uh so yeah because i think i think i might be able to do it but um, in the interest of getting you guys video uh, the automatic rifle does not blow up the, uh, the barrels very quickly there. Oh damn, I thought it was going to bring me up one and on fire. There we go. Let's take him out one at a time. Be careful, don't run in the middle. I did that once uh, to try to get from one area to the next, and it did not work out very well. So we murdered everyone in the mountain. Now we're murdering everyone working on the endurance. Um, doing this, this detail, whatever they call it. Long range shotgun! Yeah, buddy! Oh, God. Alright, we got him. So, like I said, keep to the edges. So that way you can't be completely surrounded. Um, another cut there because I died, I think. I don't know. Exactly what happens, but whatever. We die. We're continuing on, killing more people, murdering all the fools. Is roughly at the same spot. I think that was one of the spots where I just ran in the middle, which uh, you know I had said not to do, and well, I did. So. Listen, you gotta listen to my own advice sometimes, guys. He just ran across nothing. He, I just killed Jesus, guys. Well, no, Jesus can walk across air. He walked across water. That's right. I killed him. Killed a flying beast. You got a grenade for it. Well, I got a bullet for your face. He really enjoys uh, your face. He's gonna actually probably stay in there for the rest of his life until your body decays and then, uh. Oh, you got. Yeah, what? What? I don't wanna have. I don't wanna hear your shit. Ow, ow. Okay, I'll take a little bit of your shit. Well, just a little bit. So right there is the little execution move that you can do with dodging now. Uh, we got that skill a little bit ago. You're going down. Keep wasting your ammo. Well, you know what? Whatever. I I have like unlimited ammo, so you could go suck a squirrel. Whatever that means. Be like a hillbilly in the United States. A second square. <laughs> There's a joke at the hill. Okay, I'm not funny. I know. I understand. I got you. I got you. You don't have to. You don't have to give me your sympathy laughs. I know you're laughing. Stop laughing. It's not funny. JK. You can do whatever you want. Oh my God, a book. I love books. I read so many books. I'm not gonna read that book, am I? No. Leave that book for later on. Here she comes. Oh, oh, no. oh, no. Is gonna explode. Freaking light. Look at that. Look at that puddle of fire that we have going on up there. Anyone comes in that area and they're screwed. 
Yeah, just simply screw them. I don't know what to do to them. I do, actually. I'm gonna murder them. That's what I do. Somebody, some guy up there that's either thrusting, um, or he's burning. Oh my god. Oh my god, there's a lot of people here. Yes! Walk in front of my gun. Oh god. No, not you. Oh god, this guy. Oh, what, 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 what? Where did this guy come from? Oh my god. He came from behind me. Where, what? How's this fair? You're not supposed to magically come from behind me. Oh, oh, what? What? You don't like fire? You don't like, I like fire. I like fire. You want to take a little fire bath? Yeah, burned it down. I think that's the other guy. Is there another guy behind me? I'm done with these people sneaking up behind me. Alright, well, he's dead. That's good. Give me some ammo. I need some ammo. What's going on? Who's shooting? Take cover. There's an intruder. There's no intruder. I don't know what you're talking about. There's salvage over here that I'm taking. Ooh, two out of three. One more and we'll be there. One more and we'll be there. One more and we'll... The heart of America feels like somewhere it must be.